Hi, how are you? I'm Zachary Barable. This is Miles the Monkey, and we are Monkey Miles. If you're interested in flying around the world in first class cabins and staying in five star hotels using points and miles to get it for pennies on the dollar, we are going to be besties. I got an entire program set up as to how you can take your travel dreams and turn them into travel reality. I got a little bit of background on me on miles on this whole setup that we got going on i also have a sizzle it's like four or five minutes it's complete absurdity of what i've been doing for the last four years when it comes to travel and flying in some of the world's best first class cabins staying in crazy hotels seeing wonders of the world flying in helicopters it's nuts so check that out stick around afterwards to see how we got into this what we're going to do with the channel and Let's just get to know each other. Without further ado, check out the sizzle. And as we say here, yeah. <laughs> How crazy is this? You're in first class. Woo! Oh my god. Today is Wednesday. <laughs> we land on Thursday and we come back on Saturday. Oh my god, my feet are frozen. <laughs> oh my god.
will come over here and you pick up, I'm not probably pronouncing this wrong, a kippa to cover your head. And the women will go over here until you can see the divide here. The yellow here, right there. Over here is Jordan, and over here is Israel. So people come from either side, pretty incredible. There you can see the Jordan, I'll back it up for you guys. Four years ago, I started the site, but the year before that, I actually was working full-time as an actor and started having a lot of back problems. So I had done shows like Make It or Break It. I had done Secret Life of the American Teenager. I did a pilot uh, for the CW called Shelter, which is where I met my fiance. And um, I thought that like my path was carved out for me. And yep, somebody else had something else in mind for me and the universe said, nope, Zach, you're gonna do this over here and we're gonna hit you in the back. And that's basically what happened. Towards the end of 2014, um, I was getting up in the morning and like I was completely crooked. I couldn't stand up straight. I had excruciating pain going all through my lower body, specifically right in my lower back. So I ended up having a surgery. The big guy had a different plan for me on this one. I had the surgery in November of 14. I was supposed to be down and out for three months, which is when I started reading all of these travel blogs. I started getting down deep, deep, deep down the rabbit hole. At the end of the three months, I was in more pain than I was before I had the surgery. And I thought that I would have recovered by that point. It was gonna be pilot season, which if you guys aren't a part of the entertainment industry, that's when all the new TV shows uh, that you see in the fall, that's when they cast them. It's a huge time for actors. I could barely stand. I was in excruciating pain still three months after the surgery. And the only thing that was really giving me a glimmer of hope or like positivity, I mean, I had, I was very blessed. I had a very loving family and my girlfriend now, fiance Elizabeth, was unbelievably supportive. So when I say the only thing, I mean sort of like professionally, personally, I've been incredibly blessed and supported. Uh, but professionally, I felt like I'd been hit over the head hard. So flash forward in May of 2015, so this would have been six months after my surgery, I put out my first blog post. And no idea how to do it. I really stumbled through it for like the first year. I wrote a post every three or four days, but I was doing everything wrong. I wasn't tagging images. The only reason I say this is because whatever is worth doing is worth doing badly until you get better at it. And sure enough, I start going to some conferences, I start reading about more and more, it starts going from something that's like this little hobby to, well, what if I have some advertising? Well, what if I create some affiliate relationships? How, have I, how in the last four years have I grown it to something that's income producing, that's doing well, that has not only provided half a million miles worth of, of travel, and I don't mean points, I mean I've literally flown a half a million miles or more. I've done travel, in excess of a quarter of a million dollars in four years. Things that like absolutely blow your mind. I've got a thing here, like these are, these are all just uh, places that I've been that at, at some point in my life were a bucket list. That's why I've got all this stuff up. It's just proof that you can do what you imagine. Like what you put out there, it's, it's, it's amazing to me. I'll show you on my phone here. This is sort of crazy. Singapore Suites. It's the third picture on my phone. I screen cap that. I screen capped this image thinking that's what I want to do. 
I don't know how I get there, but that's what I want to do. And I remember hearing Zach Levi on The Tonight Show describing the Singapore Suites. And I thought, oh my God, you either have to be a movie star and they're going to fly you like that, and that's just a perk of the job, or you just got to be raining bills. And I did it. In fact, I did it with my mom and my dad. And we paid, I think, 50,000 points apiece transferred from Amex over to Singapore Airlines. And I think our taxes and fees were less than 100 bucks a ticket. Unreal. They're pouring Dom Perignon. They're pouring Krug. They're doing the whole thing. And it was the third picture on my phone when you go back chronologically. Stick that stuff in your head. Make your vision board. We're going to do what we can to make those dreams come true. And we're going to start creating a blueprint for that. So... That's what I've done. That's what I'm gonna to continue to do. I'm so excited to just get out there, start videotaping even more stuff, getting out regular programming to you guys, interacting, doing the whole thing. I'm really excited. Thank you for tuning in. Please like and subscribe. And if you wanna support the site, use the links. We are so, so grateful. Thank you so much. And as we say on the site, 